The process starts from the farm, a bountiful harvest for these farmers in Afgoi. They plan to export dried lemons and revive the once booming lemon production industry. For 60 to 90 days, this team will monitor the process. Throughout this time, they make sure the lemon completely dries up. On rainy days, it is completely covered up to prevent it from rain. This is the first process. We dry the lemon before we load them into sacks. This process takes 40 to 60 days, depending on the weather. This time we waited for 90 days. We make sure the lemon dries up completely and then later export them to Dubai. A source of income to many. Young people in the rural areas work in these farms. I have been working on this farm for the past four years. We export our lemon to the United Arab Emirates. My friend and I feed our family from the money we make here. In the past, Somalia was among the African, Caribbean and Pacific countries that traditionally exported fruits to Europe and to the rest of the world. And these farmers in Afgoya say they are on a mission, that of returning Somali fruits back to the world market. Farmers say the timing is perfect for the revival of the Somali agriculture produce. Already, Somalia's banana export is among the factors that encouraged these farmers. Its close proximity with Middle East is also another factor. These farmers now hope to secure this market. We have a ready market for our lime products. We supply to the Middle East market. Our prices are very competitive. We offer high quality oranges that have been properly dried and we are not challenging the Latin American countries. Government forces and African Union troops continue to push back the Al-Shabaab militants from southern Somalia, allowing farmers to return to their farms in large numbers for the first time in many years. Abdul Aziz Bilal, CCTV, Mogadishu, Somalia.